Alright folks, welcome back. My name is Sergio. This is another Silver Moon production. Today we got around at Green Jay, also known as McAllen Disc Golf Park. We got Stan Harvey. We got Erica, myself, playing Green Jay today. I was able to capture most of the shots to help my beautiful girlfriend Layla. So, see how it goes, folks. Thank you. Alright, so we saw Eric hit the tree on his first drive. This is his second shot. This is Stan's third shot, I believe. We missed the second. Landed way off to the left of the trees. I go up and over. So this is Eric's par shot. Behind that ugly cactus. Landed in the right spot, skipped away. My three, my three. Eric to try to save that. All right, I believe that was four, five, and six respectively. This is myself teeing off on hole two. I threw my Firebird straight into the ground, left side. Still had an open shot. This is Stan. He cut out a little early. Eric. The nice Andy. Up shot. Had a little gap between the pole and the tree. Decided to change stances at the last second. Leave a little more forward. Leave it to get out there respectively. Eric, smooth up shot. Nice. That's Stan. This is for three. Eric as well for his par. Oh, unlucky. And Stan tapped out. So this is me teeing off for three. Firebird way early. The second I let it go, I knew it. Eric, a little slower disc. Trimmed a little tree, but still managed to get up there. Stan taking a more straighter route. This is his upshot in that tree. It's a 50-50. Landed right on the edge of the sidewalk. Again, my Firebird. Make sure I wanted to put it further rather than shorter. Got up there. Uh, this is Eric for Bird. Tap out three. Tina 4, my Oregon Destroyer, jumped off the tree, cut to the middle rough, this is Eric, pumping one down the pipe, a little flat, I think it skipped OB, and we got Stan, a new up and comer by the way, shout out to my boy, got a lot better recently, this is Upshot. Upshot right here. Getting the last second switch. To my Firebird. Flick. About 22 out. Stand with the Nova. Barely missed. Myself to clean up. Three. Eric stand on the phone still got it and uh, all right now we got one of my favorite holds at the J hole five you're a little uphill you got a very nice fairway slight dog leg to the left able to pump it semi straight get over those trees 
Nice feel on this one for sure. We got Eric, X step, back. Nice line, maybe a little high. The 550 part three. We got Stad. Get middle fairway. Up shot, you can see the basket. Got a little understable on him. Got Eric out in the open. Can smooth release. A little right on the edge of the fairway. Again, told myself get it further rather than shorter. The disc fly. Decent up. We got stand for three. Go left them a pop. Got Eric from about 40. Mm, just tickle the chains. Again, I believe this is for three. Able to get that. All right, now moving on to hole six. Baskets under the canopy to the left. OB to the left, which is the dried out pond, still marked off. Put a clink somewhere in there. That's an ideal shot. A nice slow skipper. Maybe that one was a little short. We got Eric. Hit the tree. This is his up shot. And we got Stan for the bird look. Behind that cactus, tricky. Hit the base of the pole. And then myself got a ugly roll away from it. And did a typical. And then we got the cleanup. What? Just rushed it. Didn't concentrate. Pay the price. <laughs> Don't do that. This is hole seven. Eric with the Annie. We got Stan with the flick. This hole is definitely catered to the strong forehand thrower. Since I don't have that, I threw a backhand flippy. Destroyer. Semi out there. We got Eric. And then a good spot was able to rip it open. We got Stan again landed in the middle of the fairway. Some drifted a little on him. Pulled out my Oregon Firebird. Left it a little short. Wanted a little more on that. Stan was just honestly saying how much of a fun time he was having right now. Left this one a little. A high and short another smooth release from Eric close enough Oof. then we got myself again about 25 out not good and then the comeback easy cleanup Psych. Yeah. No. Yep. Mm hmm. Take that. Hole eight, one of the longer part threes here at the J. Yeah, Eric being a little bit of an Annie. Stan again. All oh, managed to get out there. And then myself. Uh oh. Trying to recover just like that. Got that yellow star destroyer. And just try to cook it a little too much. Beautiful day at the J today. 
I am out the crew. What else can we need? Wind started to pick up a little bit. Right to left. Again, took my destroyer, tried to pump it out. And again, left it high. Uh, didn't commit to it fully, so it cut out. Now, I'm trying to save a four. This is Eric. I don't know, further down the fairway. A little awkward run up. Still managed to get that full pull. And again, a little more off to the left than desired. Stand, Mr. Center Fairway. Center cut fillet. So uh, again, right in the middle. Run up. Boom. Not so much of a run up, but good. Set up. And again, looking at it. This is Eric out to the left. Trying to lay up to it. Decent shot, not bad. Should have that putt. Myself. Again, threw that firebird out there. Trying to make it come back. Eric to clean up. Got it. Uh, I think that's me breathing because I was recording. My bad. Oh, did not deserve that one. I got it. And our beautiful recording artist the other half of Silver Moon shout out alright again another one of my personal favorite holes at the J hole 9 over the water or what was the water into the island uh, we're not playing island today but definitely the spot you want to be for a good shot <laughs> fortunately stand here a little early and myself with the firebird again trying to keep it flat trying to give it more power than needed because looks are deceiving on this one still landed short <laughs> if the water was there obviously he'd be waist deep in it but it's different times now so we good pumped it and again a little understable for Stan I was just telling him a little more overstable disc we got him his shot from the side of the OB Eric a little short good bid though and then myself hit the railroad tie landed right in front of it and then typical yep cleaned up cleaned up cleaned up we got 10 open fairway then you got to get into some trees and Eric did exactly that skip perfect can't ask for much better than that I went again a little high then did in the mush we got Stan with the flick you gotta look the J is serious place the left of it it's definitely no death I was in the thick of it, managed to firebird out and park it one foot away. It's a give and take, give and take. And got camera work through the bushes. Uh, a little low. Second shot. We try to this guy. Joined us the whole round today. Trooper. Got the cloud mouth hole 11. Just slight dog leg to the left, mostly mid ranges, easy. Little over the mandor, like you said. Stand the man. Good, nice and straight release. Able to get again right center fairway. Through the Philly Special Commander. Getting a little short, little left, but still looking at it. Got uh, Stan. Tickle, tickle again. Getting better at it. Then myself, I said, okay, I don't want to fall forward with momentum, so let me clear this space up so my hand doesn't hit anything sharp. Committed to it. Still messed it up. And still got hurt. Ew. See that? <laughs> Alright, I got Eric. 
Get it. Cleaning up. That bloody putter. It's no joke, fellas. This is real right here. It's one to twenty. <laughs> Rub some dirt on it, sweetie. We got twelve. Stand on the box. Forehand specialist. Basket up on the hill. Threw it out. I believe not bad. I got my new Firebird again. The Oregon stamp. Felt good. Just left it way short. Still getting used to that one. We got Eric again. We've been seeing the backhand Annie from him. Couple round, couple shots this round. There it is again. Find myself caught in a sticky situation. I'm gonna just Luna it up there. Feel good about that three. Take it and walk away. Eric just missed it. Again, Stan hits the band. Clean up. Clean up. 13. I said to myself, get it past the basket. Again, let my arm just throw it high. Eric with the perfect shaped shot right to it. About 15 out or less. Good shot. Stand low, cut left. This is my up shot. Bit off a little more than I could chew. Should have just thrown a different disc. Took the three. Risked it, pay the price. Stand, bend again. This is a should get. No more than 20 feet out. Let's completely airballed it. Yep. So, I went to the other water and said, okay, go for it again. <laughs> And guys, I just want to take a quick second to shout out uh, Local Lines Disc Golf. Carlos and Courtney really do a lot to support the game down here in the Valley, both the men's and women's side. So I just wanted to give them a quick shout out. Thank you for what you do. Hopefully we'll see you a lot more in 2020. Uh, back to the footage. Uh, we got Eric on 14. This one has a low ceiling, so the trick is keep it low. Let the disc skip up to the left towards the basket, which was a good shot. Now we got Stan. Same idea. Executed pretty well as well. Past that main tree that we always want to get past, up towards the fence, looking at a putt. I got myself, choppers above. Cranked that Firebird. Felt good. Maybe a little, maybe like 10 more feet. Would have been good, but hole 14 again, folks. So again, these are our putts for Bird. Stan, about 37 out. A little less for Eric. A little uphill putt. Short left side. That was about pin high, maybe 22 out against the wall. Just again, didn't commit to it. This is our cleanups right here, Eric. Stand by myself. How are you feeling? All right. Such <laughs> <laughs> so is behind the scenes, silver moon. Shabakery. Got 15, another tough one. Big dog leg to the left with the hill incorporated with it. OB to the left and right. Stand. Managed to swivel past there and get in a decent spot. Um, Bob said, just get it down there. One of the best shots I've ever thrown on this hole. Which will result in absolutely nothing, as you'll see. Uh, Italian place? What Italian place? It's called, uh... <laughs> yeah. Olive Garden, the OG. No. So we got Stan 
Upshot looking a little good, a little short. Eric still has some work to do through some ceiling and palm trees. Again, that smooth release paying off. And then I got myself, which was the best drive. Maybe about 170 out. So let me take my putter. I said to myself, don't go don't go short. Don't go short. I went 80 long. Look at this guy. Fun times with the J. So this is to save my par. Again, about 65. Clinked it. Stan heating up. Eric takes the lead. Another Annie from Eric on 16. And we got Stan flexing it out there. Good shot. I can see him throwing my ducks. Go ducks. Destroyer, I wanna get it. I wanna hit the fence. That's what I'm telling myself. My body language tells me I didn't commit to it. Still left it about 35, 40 out. This is Eric. His upshot. Stan's got a tough look behind the tree. He tried it at least. Um, I mean, what can I say? I've been doing it all around. <laughs> and we got Eric so close to OB under the fence, but cleaned it up. All right, we got two left, hole 17. I just hit the bird. I'm feeling good. I pumped it. I'm asking it, please, please. Did not listen along the fence. Got Eric. That's what it is. I've never seen that. That's uh, a good one. Stan. Early. Uh, up on that one. Looking at a four. So. I tell myself lay up. Which I did not bad at. It's me cleaning up three. Trying to put the pressure on Eric. So the birdie before brought me one back from Eric. His bird oh, floats on him. And this one's for par. Oh, left it a little short. Which ties the game coming in to the last hole. So high fives, high fives. Here we go. I said I got this. And my destroyer just didn't say the same thing. Got Eric. X step. Good throw. He's been executing the whole round. And we got Stan. Pull back throw. This one I believe floated on him a little bit. Landed in the cactus. And this one <laughs> was uh, a victim to the street. <laughs> Wasn't able to catch my upshot throw, but I landed to the left before those cactuses. About a hundred before the main hill. Right about here. And I threw my monster, hoping it would hide you a little sharper, let myself down. And I uh, landed about here to save four. So this is pretty much a game. Committed? Nope. Let's just stand. And this is Eric for the game. Shout out. Unsportsmanlike conduct. Throw a flag. Oh, no need for that. Well, folks, I just want to thank you again. Uh, hopefully, you have a lot more videos coming up this year. I appreciate the support I've gotten. 
And uh, hopefully I'll see you out on the course soon. Shout out RGV Disc Golf Club, Silver Moon. Love you, baby.